Now, the breaking news, David Hay has released a statement saying he would be happy to assist the boxing authorities in their investigation of his brawl with Derek Chisora. Well, he apparently has blamed Chisora for instigating the fracas on Saturday night. Stay with us. We're going to be hearing from Adam Booth, Hay's manager, very soon. And just a little bit more on the statement that uh, David Hay has released in the last uh, 15 minutes or so. And he's gone on to clarify why he's had to issue the statement and why he was in Munich. He said, with regret, I feel I've had to issue the statement to clarify certain matters following an unfortunate incident that occurred on Saturday night. I was in Munich to watch the WBC World Heavyweight title bout and provide punditry as well. He said, during the post-fight press conference, I was stood at the back of the room. It wasn't until Bernd Bonte said my name and involved me in the press conference that I commented. I was then happy to banter back and forth with Bonte and Klitschko, keen to ascertain whether he, Vitali, would stay true to his word and reiterate his desire to do what his younger brother couldn't do, and that is knock me out. Hay went on to say, I felt as though the public would want to hear more information about this potential bout and that we could both start beating the drum ahead of a showdown later this year. Well, however, at this point, Jazora began firing insults at me from his position on the top table. In fact, he's recently made a habit of saying derogatory things about me in the press. He goes on to say, regrettably, some members of Jazora's entourage also encouraged the chaos. Thankfully, it didn't take long for the ruckus to again settle down. It was then I heard Chisora say he planned to shoot me dead. However, I decided to leave the venue and return to my hotel, a move which I hoped would diffuse the situation. Consequently, I left Munich on an earlier flight on Sunday morning and have been t uh, thinking about what happened ever since. So those, uh, that, that just part of the statement from David Hay this afternoon. As I said, we are we're just waiting for uh, an interview uh, with uh, Hayes coach Adam Booth, who was also uh, injured in the fracas. He uh, seemed to get an injury to his head, and actually we've got that right now. Let's hear from Adam Booth right now. A little statement from you about now the dust has settled, how you feel, how David is, you know, that uh, kind of so stuff. David's put out a press release. It's, I, think, it's, I think it was sent out about five minutes ago. Okay. So that explains his side of it. What does it say? Uh, if you want, I can read it to you. <laughs> um, it's gone out. It just says, uh, it's a shame. It's a shame it happened. But it did. Just got to move on. How about you? How are you? I'm all right, thanks. Yeah. Back to work. The cut's gone. Gone where? Is it under your hat, is it? <laughs> <laughs> what were you hit by? Were you hit by the tripod? Uh, no. no. What no. were you hit by? Something. Don't know. Doesn't matter. The German police are saying they want to speak to, to David. Uh, what's, what's the score on that? Uh, well, I, they, they've made no contact with me, so if, if they want to speak to him, he'll be more than happy to, to speak to him. And now that you're looking back on what happened, how do you feel personally about it? I'm just, just tired because I didn't really have much sleep that night, so I've got to get back to training now because I've got my other fighter that I've got to get into shape. That's all I'm thinking about. Can't waste any more time thinking about it because I've got a serious job to do. Do you regret it happened? I think everyone does. You know, I love our sport. I love the sport of boxing. I believe the sport of boxing is the best sport in the world. Um, and, and anything that makes, you know, boxing look bad is a real shame because it is such a great sport. And, and with that said, I've got to get back to it. And just finally, there is some suggestion that perhaps it was some kind of pre-planned event, you know, a publicity <laughs> stunt. I didn't get that memo. <laughs> if I had, I might have ducked. What about the British Boxing Board of Control? If David does want to fight again, do you think he'll have any trouble getting a licence as a result of what happened? I'm not, I'm not, I can't answer any questions on David's behalf or the Board of Control's behalf. You really need to ask them about that. Where, where is David now? Uh, don't know. I'm, I'm not here for him. He ain't training with me at the moment. But he's in this country. Uh, you've, got to, you've got to find out from him. Thanks very much. <laughs> All right, cheers. cheers. Thanks, sir. There we have it. The latest there from Adam Booth. More on that as we get it. England batsman...